In today's video, we're going to compare a set of Blackwood McCallum pipes with a set of McCallum made McCray pipes. Stay tuned. Well, hello everybody, I'm Matt Willis Bagpiper, and on this channel I make videos to make you a stronger and more confident piper. If you like this kind of content, please think about liking the video, subscribing to the channel, and hitting that bell icon to be notified of when I post new videos. I also teach Skype and online lessons if you want more personalized instruction, but more on that later. All right, everybody, I am very excited. Today we'll be doing a head-to-head -head play test between a set of AB4 Blackwood Deluxe McCallum bagpipes with a set of McCallum made McCray pipes. These are the SL2 model right here. And I want to thank Mr. Robert Rial and Ms. Karen Mooney for letting me use their particular instruments. They're both patrons and students of mine, so thank you guys so much for letting me use your pipes today. And in this video, we'll be using the McCallum Kell Chanter in both sets. In fact, it's the very same chanter and reed I'll be using in both of them. Now, the stock diameter is different between the McCray and the standard McCallum, so I did have to add a little hemp to the Kell Chanter to fit in the McCray stock, but it is exactly the same chanter and reed in both examples. Both sets have easy drone reeds with an inverted base. You can see here the standard easy drone tenor and over here we have the easy drone inverted base. Now these are different sets of easy drones. They are both set up specifically for the pipes they're in. There'll be a photo gallery at the end of the video of both of these sets of pipes individually and together so stay tuned for that. And for those of you that don't know one of the things that makes the McCray line particularly exciting is the middle tenor as you can see right here actually has an M engraved on it because the bore of the top is slightly different. That's based on Stuart Little's own set of classic McCray pipes and when they analyzed them they found the tenor tops were different so they incorporated that into the design. The standard McCallum pipe has matching tenor tops which would be all but interchangeable though I do like keeping sets of pipes together. All the parts, all the middles stay together, all the outers stay together. So let's hear a couple of classic three fours. I'm going to play first the standard set of McCallums then the McCray pipes right here, also by McCallum, and then at the end, I will edit back and forth between the two so you can take a listen side by side with the same channel how these pipes differ using the same mic settings and everything else.
So now that you've listened to both sets individually and comparing them side by side, what do you think? I'd love to hear your comments below on your impressions of each set here. I am hard pressed to say which one I love more. They are both fantastic pipes. They're both made by the same company, um, but I really do feel they have quite a bit of a different response on my shoulder. The McCrae's here are currently tied into a Canmore hybrid bag, while the McCallum set is in a Ganaway bag with grommets and zippers. So they are in different bags, just keep that in mind. I didn't really notice much of a performance difference between the two bags, to be honest. I thought they both felt great under my arm, but just for full disclosure, they are on different bags. Well, thank you so much for watching, everybody. If you got something out of the video, please think about giving it a like, subscribing to the channel, and commenting below, again, with any thoughts you have on these two fantastic sets of Pipes by McCallum. I also have a Patreon where as little as a dollar a month goes a really long way to helping support the channel. You'll see names scrolling up of some fine folks that contribute to the channel every month. I want to give a special shout out to Miss Carrie Tresak, who is one of my top supporters. So thank you so much. I'd love to add your name to this list. You get early access to videos and other perks, so check out my Patreon page. I also teach Skype and online lessons. Go ahead and head over to www.commandyourbagpipe.com or email me at the address you see down here and we'll get you going. I'm working with folks from all over the planet and I hope to work with you soon. I also have a line of Command Your Bagpipe merchandise, like this fine shirt I'm wearing right here. But there's also t-shirts and mugs and hoodies, so go check that out and let the world know that you command your bagpipe. All right, everybody, I'm Matt Willis, Bagpiper, and until next time, cheers. <laughs>